Hey Kaboom guy, have you seen my new hell of a revolver? 357, huh? That's right. You got something big like this? Yeah man, that's pretty cute. That's that's nice. That's that's a cute gun, huh? Did you say cute? It's 357. What do you mean cute? It's 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 the biggest one that you can possibly get. Yeah, I said cute. It is cute. And no, it's not the only big uh, revolver that you can get. That's the big one. You guys are back to the Kaboom channel. We're gonna make this video a short, but maybe a little bit fun and painful. Come close by. What I wanna try to do is I wanna try three different um, rounds on the 500 Smith & Wesson. Uh, one of them it's about 350 grain, which is this bad boy. And then the other one is 400 grain, which is this bad boy. This one is 700 grain, which is this bad boy. And for comparison, that's a 357. So it's just a cute little cutie right there next to them. The rounds that I'm gonna use, see, this is the 500 Speed and Western uh, 350 grain, which is this one that I showed you. The other one, it's the 400 grain. It's a MacTech uh, 400 grain. And this one, I don't have the box and we only have one left of it. I'm gonna go ahead and put a slow motion right next to me. I'm gonna shoot a, shoot a 357 captured on a slow motion to see how it is. And then we're gonna move from the, uh, the lighter round to the heavier round and then see what happens. Am I on GoPro? Yep. You see anything? No. You don't see anything? <laughs> With the head he says, yeah, yeah, yeah. And he says, no, I don't know which one you... You have to remove your eyeglasses and the way the GoPro works is you have to turn it on. Turn it on. <laughs> <laughs> uh, now look to see if I'm gonna, let's make it straight, if you know what I mean. Is it straight? Is it gonna show on the camera? I mean on the GoPro? Yeah. Okay, perfect. I think I dropped something. There it is. All right, as I told you, let's start with the 357. Capture that slow motion. And then by the way, I tried to be creative and make this intro. I don't know if, it, if I'm gonna post it or not. I'll try to see if I can make it presentable. Hopefully it is. Let me know what you think about this intro. Should I just cut those intros and go straight to shooting and not talk at all? Maybe that'll be fun. So when I tell you to hit the GoPro, hit the GoPro. I mean, don't hit the GoPro, just hit the recording go button. All right, I'm ready if you want to hit the GoPro. Just bring it back a little bit. Oh, there we go, perfect. Is it on picture? Yeah. So let's do some kabooms, kabooms and kabooms. Uh... All right, so that's the kick that you see. Got the GoPro. This is gonna be a painful video. Already shot this once. Huh? All right, so we're gonna move to our, uh, what a windy day. Our, that's the camera. 350 grain projectile out of this uh, huge 500 Smith and Wesson. Uh uh. Hit the record button. All right. You ready? Yeah. Eyes and ears. Kaboom. <laughs> You can stop the GoPro. Oh man, that hurts. It's very man manageable, like for someone that shot that multiple times before, but it just every single time, no matter how you hold it, what you're doing, it just hurts. It's just painful. 400 grain, another round. So this is gonna kick more. I shouldn't have started with the more and just move to a less painful rounds. You ready? Yeah. All right. That's what she said. She said, ready. Go press rolling. Eyes and ears. Kaboom, kaboom. Ah, you can feel the difference, dude. That was 350 grain to 400 grain, so not much of a difference, but still.
the 700 grain you can hit the GoPro this is gonna be a very short video but well you know what I'll just bring another one to just make it fun anyways you ready yeah all right eyes and ears Ooh, this is gonna hurt ah! That, that did hurt. GoPro is not rolling anymore. What did you get hit with? I don't know. Something. I'm hitting like 400 yards away, so there's no way something's coming back. Maybe it's, maybe it's doing the same thing yeah. that the Taurus is doing. <laughs> All right, so for to make it fun, let me shoot as a comparison let me shoot a nine millimeter uh, we'll capture that and then i'm gonna shoot something else at the end to see what the difference is all right so let's compare it with the nine millimeter this is a glock 19 let's shoot it oh that was cute and then i didn't have my eye uh, ear protection on <laughs> thank you for letting me know about it <laughs> so that was pretty like you you enjoy shooting it after you shot that caliber. Oh, all right, let me bring the other one that I was telling you about and then we'll just wrap this short video up. All right, so now it's time to shoot a 308 rifle. <laughs> it's not a rifle, it's a pistol. It shoots a 308. And this big old round, the way that you load it, you open up this bridge basically, you put it in there, you lock it up, you cock it up, and you shoot it up. That's how you do it. This kicks too. This kicks pretty much close to the 500. All right, we have one loaded in there. You can hit the GoPro now. We are locked and loaded. Eyes and ears. Woohoo! Wee! This is gonna hurt. Not bad to be honest. Oh, it's definitely not as bad as the 500 though but still and again this is supposed to eject the shell it doesn't i have to manually take it out it's a single round very short video i hope it was fun i, I don't know if it is i'll figure it out when i'm editing it but what i can tell you for sure is thank you for watching i hope you enjoyed it and i will see you 